Hello again, Roy Zestot, Realtor here with Coldwell Banker Legacy in San Angelo. Today I want to talk to you about pictures and video. When you get ready to sell a house in particular, pictures and video are very important. One of the things you ought to do when you're working on selecting an agent to use is look at their other listings. Look at the quality of the pictures and video that they're doing on their other listings. Odds are the same quality they're using there is what they're going to use when they list your house. It's very important because it's it's marketing. I mean, when you're what, that's the primary one of the primary jobs as a real estate agent is to market your property to help sell your property, and then part of that is presenting it in the best light. Think about it. Walmart goes to sell a two dollar widget, and they spend hundreds or thousands of dollars taking really good pictures of it to be able to present it in the best light. So you want somebody that'll do the same when they get ready to sell your house. They don't necessarily have to be have to hire a professional to do it. Although I I do because. I'm just not that good a photographer. But there are agents I know that, that take really good pictures themselves, and that's perfectly fine. But the key is you want to get good quality pictures. Video is one of those things that's really taken off in the last five or six years in particular. It's interesting, when I do a, a post on Facebook now with a new listing, I've done it a couple of times where I did them side by side, one of the listing and one just of the video of the listing. The videos will get somewhere in the neighborhood of 10 times the views that the listing was. People won't just click to go to the website and look at stuff. They'll click to watch the video. So it's just amazing the, the attention that videos get today. So that's very important. Now, videos are expensive, and if you've got a real low-level property, sometimes it's difficult for the agent to, to be able to afford it. The other thing is, even for the buyer and the seller, videos in particular help the client be able to get a, an idea of what the house is going to look like on the Internet before they get to it. So what it does for both the buyer, the seller, and both their agents is it means you have to look at less houses. So if a buyer has to look at less houses, well that means the seller has to leave their house for showings less often. So a video can help present your house and help someone see, oh no, that's not the house for me, or to see, ooh, I'm really interested in that house, I wanna get a closer look at it. So I think that videos are very valuable to, to everyone involved in the process because if you're buying a house, for example, you, it's, you don't want to have to go look at 20 houses to find the one you want. If you can look at 30 via video and say, and, and from that viewing, mark off 20 of them, and then only have to go look at 10 houses, well, that saves you a lot of time and money and hassle, and just sometimes they get jumbled in your head when you're trying to, you've looked at so many, you've walked through them and that kind of thing. So anyway, pictures and video are amazing tools. <clears throat> One of the downsides of Zillow and some of those kind of places is they won't show you the videos. If I produce videos for a property that I'm listing, you don't see those on Zillow. Zillow has a deal where they want me to pay extra or to go through and record with my cell phone, do a video or something like that. But that will just show on Zillow after I've paid to have a professional quality video done of a property. So it's one of the downsides of them. It's one of the reasons to go to my website to look at properties because you get a better view of different things. So. It's one of those things. Pictures, video are very important in the marketing of your house. So, so select wisely when you are hiring an agent to help sell your house. But even as a buyer, find out, look on YouTube, wherever, because there's our multiple listing service in San Angelo, for example, doesn't have videos on it. So you've got to go to the individual websites. It's a little more work. Or ask your agent, say, hey, is there a video of this house? Show it to me. You know, look for it on Facebook or YouTube or whether other places that you can find videos. Look at those videos, they'll help you sort the houses as a buyer, they'll help you sell your house as a seller, they make it better for everybody in the process. So, just a little bit about videos today, Roy Realtor, 325-268-0775, thank you.